In stage 29, we're going to be attaching the heat sink and cooling fan to the head block. And for this, you're going to need the fan, the fan cover, and the two screws, which are the M3 truss head screws, 26 millimeters, that were supplied with this stage. Okay, you're going to need the head block assembly from the previous stage, and also the heat sink, the fan draft blocking strip, and the thermal grease. Okay, first thing that we need to do is we need to apply some grease to the heat block. Okay along this section here all right, where the three holes are making sure that we don't get any grease into where the three holes are okay so once we've done that and we've put the grease on we then get the heat sink and the heat sink will have two holes and one large oval hole and with those two holes those two holes we will need to line up okay with thermal block and then insert the two screws all right if you need to adjust the heat block out of the way to do that then that's fine as long as you keep that one millimeter gap all right so go ahead and do that and then we'll come back and we'll attach the fan Now once you've done that and you've just placed the screws in there temporarily, take the fan draft blocking strip and place that into the bottom slot like so. Okay. Next, get your fan ready, okay, making sure that the wires and the fan are facing in this direction as shown in your instructions. Okay, so in that direction. Carefully remove the two screws that we've just lined up the heat sink with. Okay. And then place the fan over the top. Then take the guard, placing that over the top, and once again place the screws back through and lining those up and then carefully once again do the screws up properly this time making sure that the heat sink is attached to the heat block and that completes this stage.